Craig, difficult day today. How are you feeling after that loss? Yeah, it is difficult. You know, it was a big loss. It's certainly not the loss that we wanted before the game. Um, I thought we improved in areas from last week. I thought the team showed more resilience and a bit more fight. But in this game again, if you're losing the gain line, you know, the corridor of power and I felt at times that we weren't folding fast enough, which meant that we soaked a lot of their uh, attack in our defence. And just those small metres turn into big metres, turn into like hard yards for a team. But they, they set the stall out this week early. I thought we saw that there was a bit more resilience there. And, you know, we've got new, three new players that have made their, uh, their international debut. We've got a young squad who are working hard and it's about us developing as a group. So um, we look back in these moments, hopefully, and see these being really important foundations. But for now, obviously, it's not good enough. We want to be more competitive than that. Yeah, France obviously were down to 14 players for 60 minutes of that game. I think they scored seven tries in that time. Yeah. Uh, I think a key issue was uh, the missed tackles. Is that yeah. something that you're looking to focus on or something that you have worked on this week? Look, it's, it, it's easy to, to look from the outside in, you know, watching a game. But these are a very special group of, of women who are um, on a journey. And it's hard for them, first and foremost, they put in so much effort and yeah, there were missed tackles and that's an area that we're going to improve on, of course. But it's about this journey for this group of players and the development of it. And, you know, the outside is important. I thought the support here was absolutely outstanding. But it's about the players and for them to realise that there is a path in front and there's a plan and we're working towards that. And that's all we can ask for. And you have Italy now away in two weeks time. How are you planning to prepare for that? And what do you think you'll face with this Italy team? I mean, look, Italy are five in the world, you know, uh, they're very, very capable, good side. I think we'll look back on the footage now and look to put together what needs to be done for us to be a better side going into Italy. And we'll look at their strengths and see how we can counteract that and look at their weaknesses and see how we can exploit that. But uh, yeah, you know, it's, it's, it's difficult. Days like this are tough. Um, the idea is now to go in and let the players know that, that their fight was really important. And um, as long as you have that, you've always got a chance, Grace. You know that you were there at me before. Uh, times when there was massive score lines. You remember in 2011, 2010, big score lines, but we got there in the end. We have full faith in this group of players. We have full faith in the plan. And it's about being brave and being resilient now and just getting through it and getting on with it. Thank you.